My journey to becoming a producer started with a trip many, many years ago uh, down to a, a very close friend's house. He had this studio at his house. I, I just loved the fact that we could listen back and we could tweak things and we could edit things and just got every part of my brain so creatively charged. It's totally possible to record a commercial uh, record at home, mix it, produce it, master it, and put it out there, and it hold its own against any other record. I've, over the years, recorded in all sorts of places, in barns, on the back of tractors. It's just about being flexible and adapting to the situations that you're in, embracing the sounds and the characteristics of those things, and just running with it. You might not want to be a pro engineer producer extraordinaire, but I definitely think that if you're a musician, it's worth having some of these fundamental basic ideas on how to operate a home studio type environment. One of my favourite things to do and one of the most rewarding feelings in the world, really, for me, is sitting down and putting that record on. I'm just going, wow, you know, I was part of that. So it doesn't matter what level you're at, it doesn't matter how you compare to anyone else, it's, that's not the way to go about this. I'm Dave Hollingworth and I'm going to teach you how to record and produce music. <laughs>